Andrew's government has committed $100 million to finalise planning for the missing North East Link. The Premier has promised to put his proposal for a tollway connecting the Ring Road and the Eastern Freeway to voters at next year's election. State political reporter Andrew Lund. Drilling rigs in the soggy ground at Greensboro as the Premier committed $100 million to make the case for the North East Link. Finishing off the Ring Road, providing that missing link that for so many decades has just not been there to deal with productivity, traffic movement, to help our economy grow and to get people where they need to get to faster. The opposition supports the concept of linking the Ring Road with the Eastern Freeway, but with the cost estimated at up to $10 billion, it's questioned the Premier's credibility. It's just absolute rubbish to suggest what he's announced today is going to deliver him a road. It's not going to deliver him even 1% of a road. The RACV argues the project is vital to help shift freight around the city. We think the federal government should also get into the kit and make sure that they contribute to this key road because it will be a road uh, of national importance. While transport groups have welcomed today's announcement, the government faces a fight from community organisations concerned about the tollway's likely impact on local amenity and the environment. You have an issue of traffic, you say, oh, we're building up a freeway. Well, that's just a 1950s solution in our view. The Friends of Banyul Group is worried about the effect on the area's green wedges. This is not really a place for a freeway. This is a place for the public. The government's promised consultation later this year. To actually look at the potential routes that um, the public would or wouldn't support, to actually identify those areas where we would have difficulties taking one particular route versus another. Labor plans to put its preferred option to voters at the 2018 state election. Andrew Lund, Nine News.